Good morning God. I want to invite you for this new week and a new day to listen to some precious words from our Lord. Did you ever observe a particular character of God? God likes to detect things and name them. Naming and calling gives a specific identity. So when we see God calling, we must understand that God wants everything to have an identity. For example, in Genesis chapter 1 verse 5, we see God created the light and called the light as day and darkness as night. In verse 8, he called the firmament as heaven. And in verse 10, we see that he calls the dry land as earth and the gathered waters as seas. And in chapter 2, we see when man was alone, the Lord brings the field animals to man to see what would he call them as. So through all these actions, we understand that God has this particular character to categorize his created things. Later, we see such a character in man too. Adam, when he sees the woman, he calls her woman and later he names her as Eve and we see that in Genesis chapter 3 verse 20. So we need to understand we have got God's character. It is a principle of categorizing in identifying. Did you hear that? Categorizing in identifying. Did you ever ask why Adam Call the woman Eve. The very words, chapter 3, verse 20, gives the reason. We can read there because she was the mother of all men. So Adam identified and he categorized. Today, you have that character. Do you categorize and keep the things in your life in its frame? Do you identify and separate or do you mix up? and mess up? Do you categorize who should be your friends and who should not? What should you do with your given time? Who hurts you? Who supports you? How should you use your name? And many other things. This is God's character. You have to place each and everything you are connected with in their own parameters. Today, before you begin your day, call your day. Categorize it by identifying each and every action you are about to take in this day. What would happen then? What would happen then? Here it is. All things would become clear. Categorizing by identifying gives you clarity. Let me say that once again. Categorizing by identifying gives you clarity. If not, you will fumble. You will be stuck. You would be confused thinking how to take the things ahead. So today, identify, categorize and walk in clarity. Identify, categorize and walk in clarity. And I'm sure at the end of this day, you will be in a position to say, it is indeed good. God bless you. Have a wonderful day as you do these things.